give you a chance. Woo! Yeah, you're good. Right. You take, take, your Holly. take your time. Holly. Oh, oh, well, Holly. Well, Holly. Yes. Yeah. Just barely getting to Holly. I love your denim. Yeah. I hope these poems are about whiskey. Denim forever. <laughs> together, Roberts, and thank you, Patrick, wherever you are, for pouring, uh, and everyone for pouring, and for being here. Woo, Patrick! The unspoken. It is heartening. Daddy Pat. Unspoken. Big <laughs> Daddy. Okay, this is called <coughs> Reproductive Labor. It has an epigraph. <laughs> By Gramsci from his prison notebooks. <laughs> <laughs> the crisis consists precisely in the fact that the old is dying and the new cannot be born. Yep. Who's the judge's dad? Now it's the Time of monsters, baby! Should have, People keep asking me if I want kids, and I don't know how to answer that question. Yeah. I suspect I might want kids, but I don't know if I want kids, because I don't know what wanting kids is supposed to feel like. I'm pretty sure I want to have had kids, you know, <laughs> and because I don't want to feel like I missed out on anything. But is that what wanting a child feels like? Does it feel similar to the desire to have paid off your bills or to have attended that event you feel obligated to go to but don't have the energy for? What does it feel like to know you want children? Is wanting kids a physical sensation? Like, when you look at other people's kids, do your loins start burning and dilating with want for something to come out of them? I can sort of imagine that. Does looking at a baby make your womb throb, your sperm squirm, your wallet pulse? I don't know, you tell me. If you want kids, you don't get sexually aroused when feeling that want, do you? I hope not. I'm not asking to make fun or because I think it's funny. I genuinely want to know, what does wanting kids feel like? When I'm hungry, the emptiness in my stomach makes it ache. Do you feel an emptiness in your torso when you want kids? At a certain point, will I get hangry for a child to fill up my nips? If I wait too long. The minute it occurs to me that I can have a cigarette, I immediately want one. And if too much time passes after that craving begins, eventually it becomes all I can think about. Is wanting a child like that? Is it a desire that forms out of the realization that you could have one? I mean, I could have had a child at any point. I could have had one when I was 13. Oh. But I don't know whether I want one just because I can have one with the same certainty that I know I want a cigarette at every moment I can have one. <laughs> or is wanting kids less of an internal feeling of lack or craving belonging to anyone, any body part, and more of a holistic, overall physical longing for another? You know, like when you've been single for so long that all you can think about is who among your friends you can convince to spoon you without it getting weird. That's the final Scott. <laughs> is it a body loneliness thing, or does wanting a child feel like it does when I see a baby animal and all I want to do is hold it? I mean, the last thing I want to do is chores for helpless animals. Those creatures just look like food to me. But I would hold the shit out of any baby animal with your leg. I don't know if that's a baby thing so much as a cuddling thing. Baby animals make great hot water bottles, by and large. I would spoon most full-grown animals, for that matter, too, provided they have fur and aren't too vicious or smelly. Well, actually, I would spoon an elephant or a hippo, probably also an ostrich. So yeah, most, if not all, animals I would definitely spoon. But wanting to spoon that raccoon rummaging in the grass doesn't necessarily mean I'm prepared to care for it by, say, showing up for all its vaccination appointments. I mean, if I haven't managed to go to any dentist appointments in the last five years, how could I be trusted to follow through on vaccinations? I guess it's not totally my fault that I haven't been to the dentist. My insurance only pays for one cat.
gravity a year, but I have at least five, which doesn't bode well for my all or nothing perfectionism. <laughs> I'm also pretty sure I'm only like 60% vaccinated for HPV, which does get to me. Is there a distinct feeling between wanting to have that raccoon in my arms and wanting to mother or parent the raccoon, is what I'm asking. <laughs> what does wanting a kid feel like physically? Does it hurt? Does it burn? Does it sting? Does it ache? Is it just a coldness or an emptiness you wish to lessen, or is it really a warmth and a fullness you wish to share? Everyone I know with kids tells me that their children are the most important things to them in the world. I don't want to die without knowing what the most important thing in the world is. <laughs> so, I know I want to know what it feels like to know with certainty what the most important thing in the world feels like. But is that what wanting a child feels like? Because I thought feeling was relative. Wouldn't the most important thing now just be replaced by a different most important thing once I have the kid, thereby making the second most important thing more important than the first thing, but instead of substituting one important thing for a different one? <coughs> Does wanting children feel like the desire to simplify your life? I work three jobs and would love to scale back, but it can be pretty overwhelming. I bet if I had a kid, daily decision making would become way easier. <laughs> you know, like productive constraints. That would be nice. But a lot of people have told me that life gets harder, not easier, when you have kids, and that kids are more work, not less, in which case that logic might not hold. I don't know what time I have left over for kids outside of working three jobs, so there's that. <coughs> Sometimes it feels really good to cook a loved one a meal or do something nice for them, like knit them a scarf or draw them a card. Does wanting a kid feel like the desire to serve another? I don't mean that in a judgy way. I'm asking because it seems like there could be real pleasure in that. I would love for the act of cooking dinner to feel more like my pleasure than my burden. Chores in general, make them less painful, please. By all means, living in the service of another sounds easier to me than living in the service of self. Is that how people come to want kids? The need for the object of their desire to be intelligibly, tangibly external from themselves? I can relate to that. I remember what strongly wanting things felt like when I was a child, but I don't think I'm very good at knowing how to want anything strongly as an adult. It's possible that because most of the time, I don't feel like I'm much of an adult. I make negative income. Someone else owns my shelter. I'm scared yeah. and overstimulated most of the time. <laughs> I have no assets, and I can't begin to imagine myself in the future. Statements that are just as true today as they were when I was a child. Do you have to strongly not identify with children to want one of your own? Because I don't know how to not feel infantilized by the conditions of my life. What does knowing you want children feel like? Tell me, in what ways is child wanting an extension of narcissism? I mean this in the healthiest sense of the word. <laughs> does, it, does it feel like the desire to look in the mirror and you know, fix your hair? Is that what it is? Or when you know you want kids and you look in the mirror, does your reflection look too one-dimensional to recognize yourself in it any longer? Does wanting kids feel anything like the desire to upgrade to an HD TV? <laughs> or is the feeling of wanting children more like the feeling of wanting to create a world in which others admire you, fear and respect you, like a superiority thing? Is that what it feels like? Because I would be down for that. <laughs> I never not want that to be. <laughs> Most of 
my friends are artists and are pretty childish to tell the truth. <laughs> Is that why I never crave the company of children? Because I'm basically surrounded by them. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
I really don't care for neon greens and pinks. If I like those colors, would I want kids more definitely? Does wanting kids feel like a want to surround yourself with certain colors? I know that feeling. Or does wanting children feel like the want for a toy? I know what wanting toys feels like, for sure. Are children just toy people? That would be fun. That's all the time we have. Thank you.